So do you notice anything? Do you? Do you? Do you? That's right. I got a haircut. Um, so sorry for the wardrobe change, but I recorded that video yesterday and I decided that I didn't like any of it. So I'm starting over. All of my school is on fall break right now, so there's pretty much nobody here because they're all at home. So that's a little bit creepy because it's extremely quiet and there's just, there's nobody anywhere. But on the plus side, I am recording this from my dorm room. Sarah. For Halloween, I'm going to be Raggedy Ann. I don't know if you know who that is or not. Um, she's a doll. Lots of people have them, I guess. Um, I had one when I was little. Um, I don't know. Just Google her. <laughs> Alex, I hope that your concert went really well on Friday and that you got a fantastic grade on your midterm. Kat, your hometown is so pretty. I thought we had mountains here, but I was wrong. We do not have mountains. They're baby mountains. Also, your pictures are so cool. It makes me want to go home and look through the old ones that I know we have somewhere. Lee, I hope the school's not totally eating your life. Um, your Sweeney Todd costume was extremely creepy. Um, the creepy music helped, but, you know, still. Um, it was a really cool costume, and your Mad Hatter idea is is really cool, too, so I'm excited. You should show us pictures. So, on to things. <coughs> but that sounds pretty. I'm with these kids for, like, six straight weeks with flu and strep throat and pink eye and who knows what else, and I don't catch anything, and I go home for a week and get sick. All right, Body Positive and Lacey Green. One of her videos focuses on where we get our ideas of beauty and who decides what is beautiful or not. Um, and one of the things that she said was that we're exposed to over 5,000 advertisements each day. That just seemed crazy to me. Like how, I don't even know how you have time to see 5,000 ads a day. Um, and the point was that with all of this exposure, how could our ideas of what is beauty not be influenced by what the media portrays as beautiful. Um, Lacey also challenges us to think about why we think someone or ourselves either is or is not beautiful and then to look at these ideas and standards and see if they're reasonable. Um, I really liked this video a lot and I'll link it below. I subscribed to her and I'm looking forward to new videos because she's really interesting and has a lot of good, you know, opinions and facts and I don't know. I just really enjoyed it. So, with all that said, Kat, to answer your questions. Um, so my favorite physical feature about myself or one that I like is probably my hair color. I've always gotten a lot of compliments on my hair since I was little and I like it. Especially now that it's not eating my entire head. And to answer the second part, what I like most about myself on the inside is that I think that I'm a good friend. Um, I like to help people, I'm a good listener, and I'm a problem solver. <laughs> um, and I would do anything for my friends, and I think that's a good quality. Um, that's also definitely something that I look for in other people. Um, I'm super excited to hear what you guys have to say about the body positive idea, and because um, I found it, I found it really interesting. And I don't know, all of her videos, I think, just make you think about why you think what you think. Oh, and mail. Um, it'll be out soon, but I'm still not exactly sure what I'd like to send, so it's a work in progress, and I'll let you know when it gets, you know, closer to existing. DFTBA and Sarah, I'll see you tomorrow.